Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toyota located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2018 Toyota Highlander Limited. Now the most suitable features on this Limited is its 360 degree backup camera, its panoramic roof, as well as its heated and cooled front seats. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2018 Toyota Highlander Limited. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this Limited is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps. Taking a closer look at the front grille, you're going to see your front facing camera for the 360 degree backup camera along with your parking sensors. Over on the side you have the 19 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Down facing camera on both sets of mirrors, integrated signal lamps, foldable mirrors, heated mirrors, and then taking a look on the inside of the mirror you'll find your blind spot monitoring indicator. Now with that indicator, it'll actually light up just looking if there is another vehicle right beside you. And the color we're going to be taking a look at today is white. Taking a closer look just at the front dash as well as the front seats, you have your brown leather interior with your power driver seat with lumbar support. Automatic high beams, auto stop and start view for the 360 degree backup camera, power lift gate release, window wiper de-icer, heated steering wheel and parking sensors. Seat memory controls, rear controls, window locks, power locks, and window controls. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your volume control, seat function mode select, as well as your voice recognition, Bluetooth connectivity, scroll function for your multi-informational display, with the lane departure alert and cruise control. It comes with the push button start, so all you have to do is push button on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up for you automatically. Now, if we take a closer look just at the multi-informational display, you have your fuel economy with the eco indicator, all-wheel drive, and sway warning. You'll find the range, compass, audio, lane departure alert, messages, and uh, auto stop and start as well. With the lane departure alert, pre-collision system, blind spot monitoring on and off, as well as a couple of other additional features as well. Taking a look at the center dash as well as the touch panel display, you'll see a couple of different features which include your digital clock. Inside the apps menu, you have your navigation audio phone as well as a couple of other additional features. Premium JBL sound system with the Sirius XM satellite radio on here. Hazard lights, temperature control settings with the rear temperature controls located on the right hand side. Underneath this little shelf here, you'll find your USB and power outlets, along with your traction control on and off, snow mode, downhill assist control, and all-wheel drive lock. Matted to an automatic transmission with your heated and cooled front seat controls for your driver and your passenger. And taking a look at the top, you have your auto dimming rear view mirror with the open and close and tilt up and down feature, well, open and close I should say, for the panoramic roof, as well as the integrated garage door with controls and your sunglass case holder. Taking a look at the backup camera, as you can see, you have those nice guiding lines and they're making things much easier for you when you back into a stall. And as you can see, you can change up the backup camera view for yourself depending on what suits your preferences. Now, when I put it into drive and I hit that view button that's located right beside your auto stop and start, it'll show you a nice front end view of the vehicle, which makes things a little bit easier for you, especially with underground parking. And then you can also keep it on the auto feature. So anything under 10 kilometers an hour will actually stay on that screen. Anything above that will go back to the previous screen it was on. Now when you're at park and you hit that view button, it'll show you a nice aerial and up close 360 degree view. The nice thing with this is that if you actually do see the obstruction, you can actually pause it and actually see what's actually in your way. And then once you hit the view button once more, it'll go back to the previous screen you were on. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate. Now located on the back of the tailgate, you'll find your backup camera just on the left-hand side and the rear hatch release located just underneath the Toyota emblem. You'll also have the parking sensors located just right across on your back bumper. And closing in on the rear cargo space, as you can see, you do have the cargo cover in the back, which is great because you can cover up your valuables just while you're going from place to place. You have the second row captain seats, but they're also heated captain seats as well, so not only does your front passenger get to enjoy heated seats, but so does your second row. As for the third row, you have a 60-40 split, so if you need more additional passengers, it is available to you. 
Underneath the floor, you're going to find some of the floor storage space, as well as your jack and tool kit. And this is also where you'll access your spare tire, which is located underneath your rear bumper. Now, the other nice thing is that you do have a power adjustable tailgate. So if you hold down the button for approximately two seconds like you'd like it at, It'll beep a couple of times when you close it and open it again, it'll open up to this height. However, if you want to reset the height for yourself, pull down the button for more than four seconds, it'll beep several times, and when you close it and open it again, it'll open up to the maximum height. A couple of uses for that power tailgate is if you're a little bit shorter or if your garage is a little bit lower, you can prevent the back of your tailgate from being damaged. Thank you so much, folks, for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Audemars Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Phone number is 780-410-2455, or please visit our website at sbtoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time.